Hey friend, you are back with the Aries Alchemist for another general tarot reading. And this is for my Geminis. So if you're a Gemini, Sun, Moon, or Rising, something in this is for you. You have the Seven of Swords in Reverse, the Wheel of Fortune, Three of Cups, Queen of Wands, Page of Cups in Reverse. And the star card. So I'll clarify those and then we'll get into what they mean. Okay, you have the Seven of Swords clarified by the King of Pentacles, or the Seven of Swords in reverse clarified by the King of Pentacles. So there's some information you're about to get that's going to help you make a decision when it comes to your stability. The will clarified by the Sun in reverse, it's like you're going to have a lot of options to improve your situation, whereas you previously felt that the situation was a little bit hopeless. I know your title. Nothing is ever hopeless, though. Three of Cups clarified by the King of Swords in reverse. One of the reasons you were feeling kind of hopeless is just because the people in your ear were giving you a lot of negative feedback, um, helping you think of things that could go wrong instead of things that could go right. But the Queen of Wands clarified by the Queen of Swords in reverse. At least one person kind of was able to actually talk some sense in you, give you some help, or not some help, but um, help you to... Think about things in just a different way so that you felt a little bit better. Page of Cups in Reverse clarified by the Ten of Pentacles. And so just that change in perspective boosting your mood is how you're able to start bringing more positive experiences into your life, I guess. So it's like hope is restored with the Star and the King of Cups. But you learned along the way like what friends are good for what instances because you have the king of cups the queen of swords the king of swords the queen of wands and the king of pentacles so it's a lot of valuable players in your life that have kind of been along this path with you whether it's negative or positive so spirit is saying just take inventory about which one of these people do you want to keep with you next year and who probably needs to stay in this year for you you got I'm empowered to write my story on clean pages and my energy is infinite so just a reminder to keep going no matter how things went before or if you were feeling sad or disappointed in those things you can always improve your situation and you are currently improving your situation Ooh. I'm tired y'all your word of the week is enjoy, though. Spirit literally just wants you to enjoy yourself right now. So what do you need to do to be happy? Whatever that is, do more of it. And we'll end this with some crystals. Aquamarine, Shungite, and Ruby. These all would help you out right now with giving you the clarity, peace, and passion needed. To pursue what you really want to pursue in life. It's time to start making things look the way that you see it in your head before you go to sleep at night. You can have what you want. It just might take some creativity to really get it. But that's what I have for you guys today. If anything resonated, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. I do drop new videos every single day. I go through the whole Zodiac once a week. If you want more information about your personal situation, this or some other aspect of your life. You can book with me through the link in the description box. Alright y'all, peace.